Well, my friends, for the past eight weeks, I've been up in Yorkshire at my girlfriend's house, along with my six-year-old daughter and my eight-week-old son. But today, unfortunately, I've got to go back down to Nottinghamshire to look after and care for my 92-year-old mother who's got dementia and Alzheimer's. So unfortunately today, I've got to say goodbye to them. So this is one time, unfortunately, where I don't want to have to say, let's go. Okay, so I'm going to be going for about six weeks because once I've looked after my mother, I'm going to be there for about four weeks. I've got to do a two-week self-isolation again. So I'll see you guys in about six weeks. And the Oscar goes to. Oh, she won't miss me that much. This little fella might, might not either. <laughs> you will. Oh, come on, I've got to get in the car. See you later. Well, I've got to say, this is not a journey that I'm looking forward to. I don't like saying goodbyes. In fact, I don't want to go. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Well, don't you just hate goodbyes? Especially ones when you're saying goodbye to the family. But it'll be interesting to see what the M1's like and the roads are like in the UK when we're all supposed to be on lockdown. Now, I have got a valid reason why I am leaving the house today. I'm sure a lot of other people have, but it should be a lot quieter. Anyway, in the immortal words of the Mac Master, my friends, Onwards. Now my only issue is, I have to fill up with petrol, with fuel, or gas if you're over in the uh, States, and the petrol pumps, the gas pumps, are full of germs. You imagine somebody sneezed in the hand and they pick up that petrol pump. Well, that's why I've got my hand sanitizer with me. Trusty hand sanitizer. If you want this, by the way, you can have it for uh, £432. I'll put the details below. Just kidding. 50 pounds, and it's yours. Right, I'm gonna pull into Asda. Interesting, I don't know whether anyone's actually noticed this. The price of fuel, while we've been in this current situation, has really, really dropped. I think it was one, 21 a litre from memory uh, before the current situation and now we'll see what it is in a minute for unleaded let's have a look unleaded 102.7 and it was 121 unbelievable how the price price of oil has dropped that is absolutely crazy. I guess it's supply and demand. Right, back in a minute, folks. A few moments later. Oh, right. And result, I managed to round it up. If it goes a penny over, it always annoys me. So I managed to round it up that time. Right, hand sanitizer. Here we go. There we go. It's about five pounds worth. I know this is not as safe as washing your hands, but unfortunately, I don't have a tap in the car. If only it was Jameson. Right. 
buckle up. Onwards. tunes on the radio now then here's a little question for you comments down below um, I used to listen to Chris Evans if you're in uh, the UK you know who he is um, I used to listen to Chris Evans Radio 2 breakfast show uh, and since Zoe Ball's taken over I've moved over to, moved over to uh, Virgin for their, for their breakfast show because I'm a bit of a Chris Evans fan have you stayed with Radio 2 or have you moved with Chris Evans We've gone over to uh, the dark side to Virgin Radio. Comments down below. The way you're talking is driving me insane. Hello. Hello. So all the signs on the motorways are all saying uh, essential travel only, um, stay safe, to say that the services are open, but I have to say the M1, eerily quiet, eerily quiet for 5pm on a weekday. I never thought I'd say this, but I cannot wait to get back to normality. Driving me insane. Hello. Just last week you called me. The way you're talking is driving me insane. Hello. Okay, so we have a few shout outs here while I'm driving along to my mother's. We've got uh, Eldon Jotson from uh, Wallingham, wherever Wallingham is, where's that? We've also got uh, Rob Tallentine and we've got uh, Tony and Sinead in Ireland. Hello Tony and Sinead in Ireland. We've also got uh, David Castles, hello David. Around this roundabout. Uh, we've also got Jane Owen. Jane Owen, hello, how are you doing? I hope you're staying safe. We have also got, just indicate here, we have also, we have also got Stuart and Wendy from Sheffield. Hello Stuart and Wendy from Sheffield. I've just passed Sheffield on the M1 actually and seen Meadow Hall. There you go. Or as some people call it, murder hell. We've got Raymond and Patricia from St. Anne's, Lytham St. Anne's, which is near Blackpool, just past Blackpool. In fact, my auntie lives there. Make sure I'm doing the speed limit here. We've also got John Healy from Colchester. Hello, John Healy from Colchester. And we've got uh, Sharon Freeman's son, uh, Manny and hubby, Trev from Plymouth. Hello there, how are you doing? Apparently I missed them out, so uh, Sharon Freeman told me I had to say hello, so sorry about that. Uh, we've also got, just make sure I'm doing the speed limit here because the speed cameras, Michael and Rita, now I can't pronounce this, from Masic in Belgium, Masic, Masic in Belgium. I'm not sure, tell me whether I've got that one right. Anyway, that's all the shout outs. I hope you're doing well and stay safe.
Okay, well, I'm here at my mum's and apparently there is a mask inside for me as well. So we're uh, going to go and find that first before I find my mother. Right, I shall uh, head on in. I've also got, how cute is that? A little letter from uh, my daughter H to my mum to say that she loves her. Right, so I've got to get my mask on first. Safety first here. That's how you do it. There we go. Have I done that right? How's that look? That suit me? Probably scare my mum. I better say who I am first, don't I? She'll think I'm some kind of masked robber. Mum, it's Lee. Oh, it's Lee. It's Lee at the door. Okay, Lee, I'm, I'm coming. Hi. Are you alright? Oh, you're looking well. Yeah, two meter all, two meters. Stay back, two meters. Look at her. She looks great. For the camera, eh? Well, I'm recording me here, Arlo. Say hello to my viewers. Hello, viewers. I hope you're enjoying the forthcoming good weather. The good weather and yes. the lockdown. And, and the, oh yes, has that come down? The lockdown? Yeah. Yeah, the, well, we're all locked in, aren't we? Well, we are, yeah. Yeah. You mean the lock uh, being abandoned? No, we're all locked down because of the, you know, yeah. the current situation. Well, it's got to be banned sometime. What has? The ban. All oh, right, well, anyway, say bye bye. We're going to get your dinner now. Ooh, I think, good. I think my sister's here. Say bye bye. Bye bye. Is your sister there? She is. Two meters, two meters. Stay back. Two meters. Two meters. How long is the arm? About as long as the other one. Two meters. <laughs> You look as bloody daft as me! <laughs> hey! Hi! Hey, don't keep it on! Keep it on! What? I look like... Why have I got a black one? I look like some kind of masked robber or something. Because well, yeah. yours is a cheapo. Mine's an expensive one. I got the cheap one? My beloved husband hey. got me this. Oh, yeah. Look at this! Got She's one. got a professional You don't need one, one. because we've both got one. Yeah. Well, I've got to keep between you both, haven't I? That's my crazy sister, by the way. She's been in other Hi. vlogs, and she, it's an improvement, that is. It is, isn't it? Everyone yeah. Says that. Yes, it, it is an improvement. Yeah. At the end of all this, I'll be a fat alcoholic. <laughs> <laughs> well, a crazy fat alcoholic. A crazy fat alcoholic. <laughs> oh well, I'm keeping two meters back. Two meters back. Anyway, I'm gonna. I'm going to say that's the end of today's vlog. Remember, because I've got to look after my mother. Remember, like, subscribe. Click the little bell for notifications when I upload new videos. Yes. Follow me on Instagram, which is... Which, where's Instagram, Mum? Is it down there? Say down there. Down there. Down there. Down there. Down Tell there. everybody to stay safe. Eh? Say stay safe. What happens to Stay you safe. Strong and strong keep your distance. Are you, are you, you look a lot better than you did this morning. Yes. Keep your distance. And stay safe. And stay safe. That's, right? How old are you? 92. 93 now, hey, is it? She says 103. 103? She's got that, about eight, eight... Well, how many miles wrong? Start counting. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> bye-bye, friends. It's time to stay safe. And stay safe and keep your distance. For your sake. Yeah, for my sake and your sake. There we go. Yes. Say bye-bye. Okay, bye. bye.